I was minding my own at the library on campus, working on this huge research project when my phone started to buzz. I looked at the screen and it said, I need you here now, stud. It was this girl from my class I'd been crushing on all semester. So I wrap up what I'm doing, pack up all my work, about two weeks worth, and head over to her dorm. When I get there, I knock on her door and she answered in fabric so skimpy, I wouldn't even begin to call them clothes. I mean, she looked awesome. As soon as I get in, she pushed me onto her bed, told me to lay down and trust her. Being an idiot, I did. And before I could say anything, she disappears for what feels like 30 minutes. So I sit there, waiting for her. She finally comes back with a shopping bag and pulls out a big roll of duct tape. It freaked me out a little, but trying to be flirtatious, I asked her, what are we doing? fixing some pipes she laughed and started to bind my ankles together and my hands behind my back she told me she had big plans for us this should have been the first sign for me to get the hell out of there but guess what i stayed she then asked in a flirty way how my research was going but before i could answer that it was going pretty well she put a piece of tape over my mouth and i freaked out as I struggled to get out, I watched her get up, put on street clothes, grab my bag with all my research in it, and walk out of the room. About two hours later, her roommate comes in and sees me. Instead of untying me, she started calling people into the room to show them what thinking with your balls gets you. Pictures were taken, people drew all over my body, and I couldn't do anything about it. I felt like a caged gorilla. After I don't know how long, her roommate cut the tape and let me go. My bag and phone were waiting for me outside the door, but my two weeks of research were nowhere to be found. And that is the day I learned not to think with my balls.